We are not reporters nor journalists. The views, information, or opinions expressed are strictly and solely barber shop talk. We pride ourselves on being uncut, unapologetic, uncompromising, unfiltered, and refuse to conform to anything less than. So if you can't, cut the cap. This ain't the show for you. Yo, Bronny, let's go into the NBA a little bit. Bronny James, man. <laughs> um, yo, they saying he not ready for the NBA, this. man. Bronny James not ready for the NBA. This is a weird take. GMs um, are saying it. Analysts are saying it. Oh, and it's not even, they're not even mentioning his health. They're not mentioning his heart. They talking about his actual game. Uh, yeah, you gonna go first? Five yeah, no, let me, let, yeah, let me, matter of fact, let me pull this up right quick. So, the way I feel about this is, I can't say that he's not ready, right? For the simple fact that he, they could, they put him on this platform to compare him for a certain thing, right? Bronny is not a dominant offensive player. He's a high offensive IQ player that can play defense, mm-hmm. right? And he's an undersized guard. So as a guard, he wouldn't be bad. He wouldn't be a superstar, but as a guard, he wouldn't be bad in the NBA, especially with the training behind him. When he was at USC, he missed majority of the season with the team. He had health issues. They had restrictions on minutes, and he had to play within the system. And because he missed half the season, they already had their kind of go-tos on that team. So he he wasn't even the first option on that team that he probably was going to be at the beginning of the year. So that changed that entire trajectory completely. But I do think he would be a good six-man off the bench or a, a backup point guard in the NBA. I don't think he would be bad. I don't know how long he would last in the NBA. He would have to he would have to gradually get better. But because he can play defense and he has extremely high IQ and put some good players around him that can shoot, he could be decent in the NBA. I'm not saying he's going to be out there dropping 20 and 30 points, but he could play defense and get you some assists because the IQ is different. That's not something you could teach somebody. Like He definitely has the IQ on the court if you watch him play. Now, can he score 30 points? He might once in a blue or whatever, but that's not his, his, his game style. So I do think he can make it. Um, but he wouldn't be like the, the, the number one option rookie Zion Williams type shit out the, out of college type shit. That's not going to be him. He's going to be like the JJ Reddick out of them, out of the league, out of college. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> We're like, he came in the league and he got a role. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Like, that's where mm-hmm. he's going to come in as. So yeah, that's, that's how I feel about it. Uh, um, I mean. I stopped believing when people see, look, all right, so I stopped believing what what people say about these athletes, you know, whether it's the GM or whether it's, uh, you know, the analysts or whatever the case may be, because it's happening right now for your eyes to see. If you're at home and you're with us in, what, 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 what number uh, is the Knicks in right now? We about to be we get closing on second right now. We third right now. Yeah, okay. I'm about to be third so right now. It, I watched the compilation of mm-hmm. – Everybody saying that Jalen Brunson was the worst pick that pick the up. Knicks could have taken. Why would they trade him? Why it. would this? Why would that? Or analysts, people who play basketball, ex basketball players, GMs, hell, the Mavs said we, we trade him. You know what I mean? And look what he's doing on a night to night basis. Look what he's becoming. Look what he's grooming into. So. We have to see for ourselves, you know what I mean, mm-hmm. what this guy is. Of course, he's not a bum where he doesn't deserve. We can all see that, you know what I mean? He's not a bum. His father's the one of the greatest athletes of all time. So we got to see, man, you know what I mean? I'm not believing what they say because Jalen Brunson is averaging 40. Well, I don't know what he's averaging, but right, he's putting it's ridiculous, bro. It's ridiculous. This is a new – oh, but let me put some context to it, too. This is a new era. A basketball, a lot of things have changed. There's, there's no need for the college thing. You got to get to the bag. Got to get to the yeah. bag. Got to make decisions for your health. You know how you don't know how long you could be able to ball. You know what I mean? If you do have a heart problem, you don't know how long, you know, what you can do. So you want to try to, cool. you know, get you what you Give me an idea, Hop. What? Didn't they say LaMelo wasn't going to be shit in the NBA? Yeah. They just didn't catch every. You know what it was? They caught everybody red-handed on the jailer. I, I got a clip. I wish we could play. It was it's bad. I mean, everybody. Stephen A. 
uh, Kendrick Perkins, the, one of the GMs on, uh, I forgot, yeah. I think it was the Cavaliers. Good looking, man. All... Appreciate you, brother. Oh, yeah, you yeah. Ha- Hancock. What's up, Hancock? Yeah, yeah so. Yeah. Wow. Hey, yeah. we, we love you, Snake Man. All right. But yeah, I, I I think he'll come in. He'll be a decent point guard. He might even be a starting point guard on some of these te- these teams, depending on what team he go to. Um, I don't think he should go to a list team. I think he should go to a younger core team that don't have nobody and let him develop basically there. Um, but because of who he is and the way LeBron is making moves and shit, it's crazy. LeBron and you, you heard what LeBron trying to do to play he with his son? Yo, he should get next to his pops. I definitely believe it. Let's break history. Bro, get next to your pops, bro. This man about to opt out of his option and sign a possibly max if they're going to sign his son. And- That's where he's going, to the San Antonio Spurs, baby. We're about to get that number one pick, baby. It's about to be lit. Wimby, LeBron, and Bronny, baby. Yeah, that would be crazy with Wimby and Bronny, though. Come on, man. It, I, I'm not even saying LeBron James. Just Wimby and Bronny. Like yeah, somebody that, knows, that has the IQ and the passing to know to, like, okay, let me get it to this seven foot six shooter. Yes. Yeah, absolutely, man. <laughs> yeah, that's tough. Love to see but, it. Love to see it. But, uh, you know, the doubt, the hate is always real. Um, He's going to have to, sh- he gonna have to prove. Um, I hope his health stays up. Yeah. Um, this is his passion. He doesn't have to play basketball. That's why I'm not, I'm surprised that people are mad that he's declaring for the, the draft. Like the man doesn't really need to do anything. His father's a billionaire. Yeah, he set up. He has so much. He has things in his name that money is not really his, yeah, his motivation yeah. by any means. So they know also what team he goes to is not about money. They know they can get him for the low ski <laughs> and a possibility low. to get LeBron. So it's, he got a lot of perks coming with him. I, I think the world about to see something that we never seen before, which is true. We never seen a father and a pop, a father and a son play. That's gonna be amazing, bro. That's the amazing. most beautiful thing in life, bro. Like I wish, I wish I went that route, bro. That's this crazy. is this is bigger than just uh, this is bigger than just the NBA. It's for especially us as black folks. You know what I mean? We get exactly. to see this. You know what I mean, this is bigger yeah. than just what Brown about. What they about to pull off is is legendary. Yeah, that's, that's why I hope he do go to the NBA, man. That nah, he make going. Proud. The way he going and it, what put it like this: if he goes and he doesn't make the NBA itself, he would smoke in a D league. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? He would smoke people in a D league. In uh, a D league, guess what? They could pull you up for ten day contracts. He can still play with his father in the NBA. Yeah. Wow. His father. His father could be like, "Yo, sign him for that ten day. It, it don't hurt nothing." Yeah, he'll do that. He'll do that. <laughs> I'll pay. I'll pay mm-hmm. for it. <laughs> yep. Yep. Hey, you know what so I mean? Like, you go pay them tickets to go to that game. Exactly. Them ten so, games are gonna be the most paid games probably in the world. Jenny Bus might. I don't know if she go use a high round because she's not going first round. I don't. But she go draft. She probably pass. She probably draft him to the Lakers second. Heck no, he not coming to the Lakers, bro. How you gonna get to the Lakers? They in the middle of the joint, bro. What? The middle of the draft? If he click declares, or only thing LeBron could do, a Bronny could do, is they could pull like an Eli Man, Eli Man, and be like, "Yo, don't draft me here. I'm not gonna play for you." Well, he said they could go undrafted or the third round, third or fourth round. So he's not going to go through the draft? If he goes through the draft pool, then a team going to grab him. Any team can grab him. Yeah, that's what I'm yeah, saying. Yeah, so, so but it, but everybody's doubting him, so they's like, they thinking nobody's going to pick him up. Look, that's the NBA what they going to hold him hostage. <laughs> yeah. They about to hold that man hostage, bro. Ain't no way. Bro. The, the NBA going to rig this shit so they can be together, man. Hey, you know what? That's crazy. That's and crazy. I hope they do. That's crazy. That's a month. That's a business move, though. Like, the NBA is still a business, so that. That's what I said. They know it's gonna be. be it's gonna be money. They gonna make that money. They gonna put them together, and they gonna sell hella tickets, bro. That's probably why the. That's probably why they saying he whack. They probably pin out they sell. Yo, he's trash. Mm-hmm. Don't get him. He's doo doo. Yeah. Him in the second right. round. For yeah. nothing. <laughs> Like, yo, yo, yep. idiots. This is- <laughs> <laughs> He's bad. This is the next Rondo. What right. He's <laughs> terrible. He can't even dribble. This is the next early Rondo when he was on the Celtics. <laughs> He's having chest problems, and then all of a sudden he just fine. You know, That's right? a fact. That's I want to see this shit so bad. 